All right, let's do it. Oh, what? You just dodged everything. <laughs> yeah, you did. Good job. Nice miss. Yes, this is this is one of mine. Uh, this is the very this is the oldest song I can think of that isn't classical. Yes. That I can remember off the top of my head. So, one of the original plans for Audio Surf was to have themes for episodes, and then I thought it was dumb because I just kind of wanted to do whatever song came to mind that I thought was good. But I already had, like, a list drawn up, so that's that's where most of mine are coming from. Yeah. <laughs> this The the episode theme is going to be oldest song you know, and, well, the oldest song I only really liked was Amore. Yeah. Oh, God. I like Amore. That's Amore. But it's kind of like I want to show off other songs, and everyone knows that's a more. Yeah. So you get an easy song, basically. Yeah, it's freebie. <laughs> you get the freebie. I've done two songs already. Three more, and I'm free. You can never escape. Watch me. <laughs> well, hey. If you're anything like your fuzzy, uh, you're an escape master. <laughs> yes, there's a gremlin on the loose, and that's by our feet. Her, her name is Izzy, and she is the most gremlin-esque dog I know. <laughs> very much so. And uh, she's a silly creature. It is very so. Who apparently cannot be contained by our mortal constraints. No, All right. no matter what we do. We, we tried to put her in the basement so that she wouldn't make noise during the recording. And, like, she just left. <laughs> she, she just left. left. Uh, and I... then Nick tried to put a chair against the door. <laughs> and she still found a way out. She and just left. <laughs> she, just, she just left. And now she's <laughs> stuck here with us. Yeah, because uh... we can't be rid of it, so we've kind of given up. There's actually two dogs here, but the other one's stuck outside, so... That one is not very bright. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, he obviously can't get inside. This one's an escape artist. Oh, if yeah, I let the, my eyes off of this little girl, she is running away. <laughs> Did she escape your yard multiple times now? Yes! Even, even though she has failing eyesight, but... Yes. <laughs> and doesn't come above a foot tall. Legs and all. Like, this dog, though. So we're playing a Louis Armstrong talking about a gremlin dog. That's yes. a good start. Hey, the song is called Deepers Creepers, so... <laughs> <laughs> that is a good point. It is. Mm. It so, does fit. <laughs> so, how did you come across this song? Oh, okay, so I love jazz. Um, and I kind of always have. My mom did too, so she gave me all of her old CDs. and She had a best of Louis Armstrong. And so when I was little, and we ever had to go on a road trip, we'd put together a big thing of CDs to listen to music while we were there. And so, uh, there was a lot of jazz, and a lot of my childhood was spent listening to Louis and Ray Charles, and then my dad was big into country, and I was, uh, ended up listening to a lot of Johnny Cash from him. So I was originally going to do Johnny Cash or Ray Charles, but it turned, I'd forgotten about Louis almost, and I was like, wait, he came before all of them! So this is, uh, one of the very first songs that I'd ever heard of Louis Armstrong. I mean... Besides when the saints come marching in, but that everyone's heard that. Oh yeah, that one that one doesn't even count. I forget. So I was I wasn't that wasn't even up for consideration. Is Louis the same guy who did um? What uh, a wonderful world. Yeah. Was. Yes, he is. How'd you know what I was gonna say? Because that's the most famous song he's done besides Saints. <laughs> you read my mic because I was like, huh, his voice sounds really familiar. I should know this. Yeah. Because me and you both played saxophone in band. So well, you should. played trumpet. No, I played alto sax. I was literally the same role as you. We sat next to each other. No, you, I just could have sworn you played trumpet. No, I played alto sax with you. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Weird. I don't know why my memory has you playing trumpet. We hated the trumpet players. We yes, always we complained. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I hated the clarinet players more. Fair enough. They were they were a bunch of prissy bitches. Yes, they were all female and all prissy bitches. Let's do it. Yeah. Whoa, holy shit, this is hard. 
<laughs> it's very visually good. It is, this is very nice like visually, this. but there's just so many fucking blocks. <laughs> Possible seizure warning here. But, yeah. Uh -huh. But yeah, I like the... <clears throat> I like the like gray gray graphics going on here. Yeah, yeah, the that grid. Is great. Yeah. Ah, and that's how so long is this song? Blocks. This is six and a half minutes. <laughs> oh, I hate you so much right now. <laughs> so, so this is Mega Drive. I am the program, and it's just one of those things that I found while browsing New Retro Wave because <laughs> New Retro Wave is good. Good thing. Is that it a is. site or is it a genre? A genre. Well, also a company. It's it's a it's a company that's sort of big into a genre and you know. Yeah, from what I remember from reading their page, it's a guy who liked this genre so much he made a company so that other people could enjoy it too. And now he basically kind of is the genre because he's <laughs> the only company that does it. Neat. And you know what? I like that guy. Yeah. So. Good on him. Yeah. Oh, God. This. Yeah, you're definitely going to have to put a seizure <laughs> warning for this. What with all the flashing colors and such. Yeah. This is six minutes long. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so many blocks. <laughs> I'm doing poorly, too. Um, I think I have a different retro wave of skin on this um, thing as well. But this one's definitely a good looking one. Yeah. Yeah. A little flashy, but other than that, quite good. I love that. I love that the fact that whenever you think of Virtual Wave, you think of grids, flashing colors of the cool variety, palm trees, and yellow or orange suns. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's very 80s, basically. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love that they did a version, I think it was an official t-shirt ah. by the Pokemon Company, with the Elon Executor. Executor. <laughs> <laughs> like that, in that style. Ah. I wanted ah. it. Ah. But I don't even know it's available yet or not. Yeah, so. but then again, you're also the one who paid, uh, what was it? $65 for a fucking plushie. Yes! I wanted it! It's a Dunsparce plushie! So I haven't gotten it yet, it's probably gonna come later this month. I ordered it like a week and a half ago. Ah. I really wanted it. It's like a foot long plushie. It looks super high quality. Mmm, we'll, we'll see if it holds up the looks. You're bonking your head into so many spikes, this song looks hard. He's it missing is. so much. There's blocks. just so many blocks, I can't get them all. <laughs> this, uh. <laughs> and also the, there's also the subtle speed changes going on yeah. there. I do notice that. Like, oh, there, oh my gosh. like there's no real stops, it just sort of jerks a bit. <laughs> You're gonna like my next song then, cause my next song's gonna be for you, Muso. Oh, what fun. I know. Oh boy. It's gonna be great. What is my next song gonna be for you? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna make it you. Oh joy. <laughs> I'm just gonna die in pretty much any song that I'm given, so. Yeah. If, if you've got a hard one, save it for someone who's not me. <laughs> I know the song that's coming for you. I don't think it's going to be that hard. I thought it was going to be hard, but it turned out not to be. But we'll, get, we'll talk about future well, songs when they then actually again, come Then again, we've had, uh, we, we, as we've discovered, having different uh, skins can drastically change just how hard a song is. Yeah, I didn't mean to give that, that <laughs> the Alien Bramble song to you looking that bad. Like, oh my gosh, I felt that really is, bad. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't realize it was that hard, but you got me with the crystal, so fair enough. <laughs> yeah. Fair game. Hey, I got myself with that fucking flat shit. <laughs> yeah, that was just a fucking clusterfuck. Uh, I couldn't see anything. That was awful. Uh, I'm gonna do... Wow, oh, I'm not gonna spoil it yet. It'll be the next song. The literal next song. Anyways, so this is a thing of vaporwave. Oh my gosh. Skin looks amazing. Retro oh, wave. No. Yeah. There's the sun. Hello, sun. It's always gonna have oh, a oh God, red, orange sun. All of them. Ah, oh, this is like choosing the best of a worst situation. You're doing better than one person, I guess. Fuck that guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck him up, beat him. 
Ha, he overturned you. He got of course he did. Because I'm doing poorly. Just don't ram into more spikes. But that's kind of the obvious thing. Yeah. <laughs> don't how, do the bad thing. How to play. Don't do bad. Do good. <laughs> yeah. That That's helpful like a brick to the head. <laughs> it might help you more in this situation. Yeah. The brick could probably play better. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> it knocks you out, picks up the controller, and completely perfects the stage. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking high quality brick right there. I call him Super Brick. <laughs> oh, wait, what's question. The, what's that your, your superhero name? He's Flying made Flying of... Brick Man? Marvel or DC, what is he? He's formed of pro plays. Uh, yeah. Actually, Image Comics. Yeah. I think <laughs> is that the same people who did Spawn? Uh, I think so, yeah. Yeah, pretty sure it is. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. Why? Oh god, the speed up! <laughs> <laughs> Why? Oh god, this is awful! <laughs> I'm just going to suck the fuck up at random! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to this suck speak for itself. This, this is just... Why? Oh. <laughs> God. This is when we fucking count. <laughs> <laughs> you tricky <laughs> cunt! Oh god, oh god! You fucking asshole! <laughs> this is so bad! Fucking fuck fucking! <laughs> oh god! Make it stop! <laughs> Oh, uh. <laughs> I've heard this song before this happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Why? <laughs> this is just one of the songs you have to appreciate just watching it. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh fuck. Yeah, you know, there's not actually a lot of obstacles going on here. It's just, <laughs> it's just how the hell. Oh god! Oh, oh god! Oh god! I told you this one wouldn't be hard per se. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> per se. Coda, For, coda, forgetting coda. value of difficulty is not completely awful. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, that's a song. <laughs> that was perfect. That was <laughs> interesting. We'll, we'll go with interesting. <laughs> we'll go with interesting. <laughs>